And when you go out of the church, go into the corner of the fort, you'll have this massive cannon. Look at that one. Firing out there at the uh, Sulu pirates. It's crazy how much the Spaniards took over this country. Welcome to a new video guys. We are still in the northern part of Palawan, close to Tai Tai. And this place here is called Kalawak Resort or Beach Resort. However, it's not opened yet. We're actually the first one ever to stay here. Me and Jordan. You. Yeah. <laughs> and this is some something else. I'll show you guys that in a little bit. I just had to climb up this coconut tree for some uh, cool views over here. This is insane spot. This is crazy. <laughs> Don't die. Now the thing about this area is it's not open yet. It's still in, under construction and development. But you can see why they're gonna open up a beach resort here. This sand is incredible. And you can go all around northern part of Palawan, El Nido, and you won't find any white sand. But here, Paradise. you do. Even even in the midst of a typhoon, it's still pure white yeah. and clear. There's literally a typhoon hitting tonight, guys. I can't imagine what it would be like in sunny conditions. Exactly. That would be the dream. You can actually see a little bit further out there, there's a black rock. And I believe we can actually walk all the way to it. Because we can see the color of the water and a little bit of sand. We've got Floyd over here. He's the manager of this area. And you actually might remember him from my Antique series. He's the one that showed me around there. It's kind of coincidence that we're here at the same time in Palawan. So he texted me, hey Finn, come over. We got something to show you. And man, my, I'm mind blown about this place. What's also really cool, you can see in the distance, black rock. Volcanic that is rock. volcanic rocks, like Hawaii. This sand is powder. Run it. Run it. or the seaweed that's what the uh, sea cow eats and it's one of the most rare animals on earth they're actually living out there that's incredible <sighs> even if typhoon is coming <laughs> we're out <laughs> swimming it's very calm now but supposedly late tonight it's gonna hit us Let's check out the black volcanic rock over there. Woo! <laughs> Let's get this thing. It's like a tiny sandbar here. But it's soft as balabak. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's a huge crab there. Bunch of them. Look at that rock. It's so black. Oh, it's good green. Comment below guys if you've ever seen a volcanic rock beach like this. The lava coming right into the ocean, just like here. Just like Hawaii. <laughs> yeah, this literally looks like Hawaii. Right. Have you been to the big island? No, I've never been to Hawaii. You've been there. Yeah, four times. Four times. <laughs> it, this is literally Hawaii. This couldn't be more Hawaii right now. Fuck the weather. <laughs> Except the weather. We got typhoon coming in tonight. Ah, we're gonna feel that for sure. Oh, slippery. Yeah, watch out, slippery. Now we're not gonna show everything from this beach resort, but I'm gonna give you like sneak peek of a few things that are around here before we come here the next time. Just like this cottage. Already built some um, decent roads here to walk around between the coast. There's four coasts with this property. And the rain is picking up.
All right, the rain is really picking up. Let's go back in. Maybe I'll show you guys a little bit around and that coconut tree. So Instagrammable. The rain in the city is really annoying. But here, out in this cove with this beach, it's kind of nice. Feels like a kid again. This place, what up? A lot of cool constructions going on here. I'm looking forward to see the progress of this place. Nice. Also, when you drive here, you have the forest made out of this tree. And they got this red blossom, beautiful flowers everywhere. It's such a cool entrance. You see this big tree? This is hardwood, shaped like a chair. Ah, just the right timing for a sunbathing. Ah, let's get some tan on and this beautiful rain. Uh. Right after uh, fun running around the beach, we got to shower the salt water. We'll just do a natural one right here. <laughs> the typhoon is coming. When I was a kid, I always dreamed about becoming a pirate. And now I got my rum. So I'm one step closer. And a hundred islands more to explore. Now the certified pirate. Rawr. these damn drones when you're hanging out with these blockers it's the day after the uh, tropical thunderstorms we got whoa <laughs> it was like two meters away from the bamboo tree wow that was close yeah it's coming again okay stop that <laughs> <laughs> this morning start of the day introduction is not going so well. I'm being harassed by a drone. Typhoon was quite epic last night, a lot of thunder and rain. Uh, today's mission we're gonna go to a lake, waterfall, and maybe see a fort. So let's get the day started. Alright, we're about to leave this beautiful spot. Kalawak Beach Resort, that's gonna be the name here. So we'll come back here, maybe next year, to see how the process is and maybe stay one or two nights here and check out the surroundings. We were about to leave and then this happened. Man, it's pouring. We can still see some blue skies, so hopefully it's gonna clear up. Actually, it is right now, so it might just be one cloud. Let's go do some fun stuff. Maybe the lake first or town, who knows. All right guys, welcome to the heart of Tai Tai City. It was actually the first capital of Palawan. And this fort behind me uh, was built by the Spaniards to uh, get a protection from the Moros. Moros are basically the uh, Muslim population that was here uh, in Palawan. It used to be a, a Muslim kingdom here. So the Spanish came here, they built this fort and kicked out the Muslims. Let's go check it out. 
built in 1667 to protect against the uh, Muslim pirates from Sulu. Sulu Sea, I think. And what's really nice about it, you can see some uh, decorations in the walls. Check this out. How cool is that? Is that the uh, uh, Spanish? Yeah. The yeah, Spanish uh, logo. This is the Spanish logo right there. Yeah. I didn't spot it until now. Check that out. Let's go inside. During a nine year period between 1730 and 1739, there were Sulu pirates. About 3,800 of them were sent to try to take over, <laughs> take over this uh, fort, but unsuccessful. And when you go out of the church, go into the corner of the fort, you'll have this massive cannon. Look at that one. Firing out there at the uh, Sulu pirates. <laughs> it's crazy how much the Spaniards took over this country. Huh. Nowadays, I've seen two big forts here in northern Palawan. One in Kulion Island and now in Tai Tai. And for those of you that don't know, the capital of Palawan now is Puerto Princesa. But before, Tai Tai. That is it from Tai Tai guys, we have one more day to explore, we're gonna do snorkeling and scuba dive and some island hopping tomorrow. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out!